rock. This just keeps getting better and better. He said it's going to be an easy mission. Just come to the base, collect data, and leave. I've never been so wrong. Launches soon, but before that happens, we're taking a trip to the Whitetail Mountains to ride zip lines, snipe cultists, see the sights, and start some fights. The mountains are filled with stealth friendly forests, massive cliffs for wingsuiting, hidden caches to uncover, and some of the toughest, most fanatical cultists in Hope County. The Whitetails are the domain of Jacob Seed, one of the cult's heralds and the brother of cult leader Joseph Seed. 
Jacob is an army veteran who trains wolves to become terrifying judges, and his presence looms large over the mountains. Only the strong survive is Jacob's mantra. Where his siblings at least try to convert the people they kidnap, Jacob is a lot less forgiving if he thinks you're weak. Call the weak! But he thinks you've got potential, so he throws you straight into a drug-fueled time trial through a hallucinatory training course. Tick tock. Jacob and his goons aren't the only army up here, though. Meet the Whitetail Militia, who are just as heavily armed and shaggy looking as the cultists, but aren't interested in kidnapping and murdering innocent folks. They're also secretive, and won't really trust you until you've done them a few favors. There's also Jess Black, a bow-carrying loner who'll join you as a gun for hire if you help her out with a vendetta against a- Stop right there! You all right? Yeah. A Way Out is a cinematic, story-driven co-op game where you and a friend control Vincent and Leo. Together, whether on a couch or online, you'll get to know these characters. Leo is brash, cocky, and quick to use force. How about this? While Vincent is calm, cool, and in control. Look, pal, you don't want to do something you'll regret. Vincent and Leo's personalities are reflected in the way they interact with the surroundings. Am I seeing double? Or are you two twins? We're twins. Figures. A Way Out's linear story will take you and a friend through a cinematic experience unlike any other co-op game. Run, run, run! Let's go! Through the story, you'll find yourself working together to survive. Leo, let's eat. Reconnecting with loved ones. She's so beautiful. Or high-stakes moments like robbing a gas station. You ready? Yeah. Why don't you give me the gun? I say we do this the fast way, man. Just in and out. I say we do this the easy way. Let's not make a scene. Nobody moves! Stay calm! Nice! Didn't know you had it in you. What can I say? I'm full of surprises, and mostly good ones. Okay, now you're getting caught.
new paths by sharing copy abilities and working together. Powerful enemies will stand in your way, including an unknown deep space threat. Can Kirby and his friends join forces to save Dreamland?
I fear I have left too much unsaid. Take care on the long road. Wheresoever you should go, the line of Lucis goes with you. Walk tall, my son. It's now your job to make it profitable and pay off the loan. This mode is designed to teach you the ins and outs of modern agriculture. Thanks to detailed objectives and helpful tips, you will learn step by step how to use farming machines, harvest crops, produce green energy, and more. It's a handy introduction to farming simulation that will make you more than ready to run a virtual farm on your own. Farming challenges are realistic scenarios that let you face extreme situations farmers around the world have to cope with. Using predefined resources, you will need to save your crops from fire, sustain the farm despite a severe drought, endure a locust attack, and more. Each of these 20 scenarios will put your farming skills to the test through sets of obligatory and optional tasks taking just an hour of your time. A bite-sized challenge that's perfect when you're on a tight schedule. The free farming mode gives you a complete freedom in how you play. Set the parameters of your game and simply run the farm your way. With all machines and facilities available for purchase from the get-go, your goal is to build a global farming empire with absolutely no handholding. Just as in real life, in free farming, your success depends on your efficiency and decision-making skills. But we're trying to explore, but you run into these guys, the Silent Watch, um, these enemy golems that are gonna try to stop you from what you're doing. So this is actually the, the training. So you see the kind of blue crystal sword that shows up. That's indicating to you like where you need to put your hands to block. We found a lot of people when they first started, they're playing it like a regular, couch game right and they're just kind of going like this and if you want to block a sword that's coming in you have to get your hand way up here above <laughs> your skull yeah Otherwise, so nice so we really um you know we it, we had to try a lot of things to get people to to play the game as if it was real yeah and, and what i love about it is that for the first time in the game any game i've played the sword control is absolutely one-to-one -one. that's awesome yeah uh, it's, you're not pushing button combos. Yeah. And cool swirly things. That's it's fun actually too, like but I have to yeah. put my sword above my head to protect myself. And, and you, you almost feel like you almost feel like you almost feel the impact of what yeah. you're hitting you. So it's pretty cool. Yeah. No, Jamie. I mean, you just have this background with mechanics, and uh, and I, I've, that's why I've been so eager to see this game because I know that you've 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 had such a huge mark on the FPS genre. You were, you were involved with Infamous Second Son. Yeah. You've been involved with a lot of great games over the years. Thank you. So tell me what you've been learning about VR as you make Golem. Oh, boy. Um, I mean, That's I a big topic. Copy, over. Bravo, can you confirm you're receiving me? Over. I'm not getting anything. They can't hear us. We're on our own. Half hostiles moving on your position. Watch your flanks. OK, enemies ahead. All right. You ready? Cover me. Enemy on the property. I see. We're getting overrun. We need backup now. Bravo, please respond. What is your status? 
joining this exciting mission to Mars. You will be part of shaping the future of humanity. You'll get to travel to an inspiring and beautiful new world. You'll research and utilize state-of-the-art technology. You'll construct a dynamic network with extraordinary facilities. You'll develop and sustain an innovative, self-sufficient habitat. You'll get to experience the captivating and energetic weather. You'll live in a prosperous and pleasant community where the relationship between humans and technology has been redefined. And just so you know, the dangers that you might have heard of have been greatly exaggerated. Be more ferociously faithful to your crew. Be more treasure grabbing, skelly fighting, and take no prisoners. Be more firing yourself out of cannons and soaring like a majestic eagle. Be more sneaking on board, stealing the loot, and getting away with it too. Be more celebrating in style and holding your grog like a chap. Oh, be more keeping one eye on the gold. Be more ganging up with solo sailors to show the world what teamwork really looks like. Be more staring down fallen foes on the ferry of the damned as you wait for the bell to toll. Be more whipping out your hurdy-gurdy and playing until your fingers are numb. Be more sailing into a storm because you can take anything the world throws at you. Be more of a scavenger, wrestling with sharks as you plunder in sunken shipwrecks. Be more headshot nailing, chest cashing, plank smashing, cannon firing, treasure hauling, map reading, riddle solving, water bailing, ship crashing, banana crunching, and above all...